नाम वाक प्रताप सिंह सारी दुनिया मुझे कैप्टन के नाम से जानती है डेट ऑफ बर्थ शायद पग देने वाली कोई पता नहीं होगा वो एक्सपीरियंस बस यही कुछ चोरी डकैतीस फ्रॉड्स फॉर्जरीज स्किल दुनिया का कोई भी सेफ मुझसे सेफ नहीं है क्या कर रहा हूँ आजकल एक पेंटिंग है सुना है 200 मिलियन डॉलर वर्थ की है अगर मिल जाए तो लाइफ बन जाएगी हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय नेम सिद्धार्थ एंड वेलकम यू टू अनदर एपिसोड ऑफ रीडर्स व्लॉग योर वन डेस्टिनेशन फॉर बुक रिव्यूज बुक रिव्यूज और इंटरव्यूज एंड हेल्थ मोर एंड गाइस टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू डू द रिव्यू ऑफ हिस्ट आर्टिस्ट बाय ऑथर फिश समीजा एंड विदाउट मिसिंग एनी टाइम लेट स्टार्ट द शो Now come to the title. He's an artist. The title is perfectly suitable for the book as the story revolves around a con man who is not only a skillful robber but also likes to do his work just like an artist will do with meticulous planning, perseverance and majestic performance. The cover quality is absolutely superb and you can see an unknown figure running away from something or towards something inside a dark tunnel. You can also see an empty frame for a portrait with a mark of a bullet shot. You go to the back and you see the image of poppy flowers the allegedly last painting painted by Vincent van Gogh that is supposed to be for around 200 million dollars in worth so to conclude the overall cover quality is absolutely superb and instantly attracts you the moment you look at it Now coming to the writing style of the book and let me tell you that I was so excited to read a book by Vish Samija as he is often dubbed as the master of Indian crime fiction and the John Grisham of India and I was so glad that I read this book because in the entire book the author has repeatedly proven that the Indian authors are no less behind than the Grishams and the Baldatis and the Pattersons and soon a time would come when with Vish Samija and other Indian authors our crosswords and landmarks will be studied more and more with Indian names rather than the white skin names Now coming to the plot of the book and the story begins with a narration by a captain about a smuggling of a arms package that goes horribly wrong. He is eventually arrested but as no primary evidence is found against him he is released on bail but as he knows that the politician come goon on whose orders he was working as well as the police are on his trail he runs away to Banaras and disguises as a sadhu. A couple of months later he is recruited by another politician come goon by the name of Udham Kumar. who entrusts him with a mission which if he accomplishes can make him retire with loads of money and the mission is to find out the person who stole in the 200 million dollar worth painting poppy flowers by Vincent van Gogh the only problem is that nobody in the world knows who has it so the captain must use his wits and skills not only for the last time but in the most dangerous and the toughest task that he has faced so far will the captain be able to find out the person who has the 200 million dollar painting if yes then will he be able to steal it under the cover of foolproof security And if he's able to do the impossible, what happens to him next? To find out the answers, read this pulse-pounding, breath-stopping stories of heist and chase that you might have never read before. Now, coming to my verdict of the book, and let me tell you that heist artist is an artistic treat by Vish Samija to anybody who likes to read action-packed thrilling story. And when you think that the thrilling part is actually over, the author surprises you with another twist and turns, and this entire sequence of twist and turns drags to the last chapter. To conclude, heist artist is a perfect weekend caffeinated read that is not to be missed this summer. And this is my verdict of the book. So guys I hope that you liked the video and if you did then please don't forget to hit the like button also if you're new to the channel then don't go without subscribing and pressing the bell notification so I'll see you in some another episode with some other fantastic book review till then keep reading keep breathing and have a nice life bye this not only for the last time but for the most bhai tu kyun dekh raha hai kya ho gaya bhai koi problem